that's what we're after here, folks. We're out on Lake of the Woods. We got a gorgeous day. We're out with Nick and Deanna Painovich. We're guests of Zippo Bay Resort, chasing walleyes today on this beautiful August day. Gonna show you everything the resort has to offer and catch some fish. You guys are keeping me busy here. Yeah, that's the idea. That's when you get on the charter boat, fish after fish. Why don't you tell everybody how you like to fish this time of year here, Nick? Well, we came out this morning and uh, we had a gorgeous walleye chop on the lake. Yeah. So uh, we've been doing a lot of spinner fishing. Uh, night crawlers, uh, Deanna is using a leech with a spinner. We're out in the deeper water and uh, doing some drifting over the edges of some of our deep water reefs. Yep, nothing too special, but you get out on the charter boats, they get you in the right area, you get them lines down, and you catch them. I might have one going here, something fooling around, or I got some. There's one. Ah. I thought it was time I joined the rank and file yep. there. You guys were making me look bad. Well, perfect take home fish. You yeah. guys got a real strong fish population in the lake now, don't you, huh, Nick? Yeah, we're seeing a lot of fish between 20, 24 inches yep. mixed in with scattered trophies this time of the year. Oh, yeah. But, uh, 15, 18 inch fish. Catch them it's all been, day long. Yeah, it's been really good. The lake is healthy and uh, we couldn't be happier with it. Lots of forage out here for the fish right yeah. now. That's always a sign of a strong fishery. We're seeing lots of year classes, small fish to big fish. and. Lake of the Woods, it's always a chance for that 30 incher to come in the yeah. boat. It's got one. Charter boat fishing definitely is a great way to come out and catch the fish. You can bring your own boat. You've got the landing right there at the resort, easy access to some great fishing. You know, and your day on the uh, charter is a good way to start your vacation. It definitely helps you find the fish and uh, Spend some time with the guys. They give you some tips on how to get on them. Again, the charter boat's got everything you need. They're set up the jig fish. You're set up the spinner fish. If you want a crankbait, they're always ready to go get at them no matter how they have to do it. These charter boats, you're so busy, you had to add another one too, huh, Nick? Yes, we did. We uh, just got this boat we're excited about. Bought another 30-footer. Yep. That's our sixth boat now we have at the resort. Yep. And, uh, of course, it's equipped just like all the other ones. We have... Uh, of course, live wells on these for our fish, but yep. we have a, a walk-in bathroom. We have a nice sitting area for all the people, a place to lay down if they like. We got a gorgeous, gorgeous sauger this time. Oh, that's a nice sauger, yeah. Beauty sauger. You can tell the difference there on a sauger. You got the, the spots in the back fin. If you look at that tail, you don't really got that white, white tip on there. Nick, why don't you tell us about the lodging opportunities? Our regular cabin, one and two bedroom, very nice, been remodeled in the last few years. Uh, we have three and six bedroom log cabin, very popular, all the amenities in them. They all have big wraparound decks and uh, very comfortable. You can accommodate groups from two, four people up to how large? Oh, up to 25, I say, in our, our larger cabins. They have, the biggest ones have six bedrooms and they have three bathrooms yep. and two full-size kitchens in each unit so very comfortable groups. beds great sleeping great fishing after you got your limit when you head back to the uh, shore there's a lot to do you got uh, a great lodge great bar very friendly atmosphere family friendly and then you got the pool and some out outside activities oh, absolutely. For them too, huh? the kids stack up big time there the pool is very enjoyable for all the kids in camp yep. and the hot tub for the parents throughout the day or in the evening when they get done fishing. It's yep. a great place to finish out your day. Yep, you can spend all day out on the lake or you go out and catch your limit and get back and relax and enjoy your vacation. When you're coming up on vacation, what you want to bring along for your own gear, if you're going to do it that way, spinning reels, bait casters, some heavy bottom bouncers, uh, you definitely can bring your own boat. They got a great landing. They got great small boat rentals there too. You got uh, flat bottoms, live wells. You got from 25 horses up to 90 horses. You get a day like uh, this, you can move around the lake pretty good, but there's always good fishing close to home right out in front of Zippo Bay. There's one. There you got him. Oh, hang on. Yep. We almost need a bigger net there, Captain. 
Oh, yeah. big old Get patty. It. <laughs> Got them in there, gold as gold can be. That is one of the prettiest walleyes I have nice. ever seen. Well, folks, right there is why you come up the Lake of the Wood. Beautiful walleyes like that. That is one of the prettiest fish I've ever seen, gold as can be. It's been a beautiful day. I want to thank Nick and Deanna for having us up. Zippo Bay, definitely the place to be up on Lake of the Woods. Catch yourself some fish like that. All you got to do is look up ZippoBay.com to plan a fishing trip of a lifetime. You're sure to have a blast. I'm Greg Jones. Thanks for watching. More Midwest Outdoors coming right up.